Right, I want to start by saying this video is not a rant at the new LEGO DLC. I'm having a ton of fun with it, uh, and if you're still sat on the fence whether you should get it or not, uh, I would definitely recommend getting it. It's a lot of fun, I'll admit. I've spent hours and hours on it already, uh, and I'm having a great time with it. Now, this video is about three particular things um, that I feel should have been addressed before the DLC was released. Um, just things that are grinding on me. Like I said, I'm still having a ton of fun with this DLC, and I, I would recommend getting it if you haven't already. Um, but there's a couple of things that I just want to address. Um, the first one being, they've only released three LEGO cars. Now, they're very cool cars. Obviously, the McLaren Senna, the Ferrari F40, and the 1965 Mini Cooper. So they are three very, very cool cars. But I know there are a lot more LEGO builds out there that they could have introduced into the game. You know, with Fortune Island, they released about seven or ten cars uh, with that DLC. But with this LEGO one, they've only released three. Uh, there is a barn find, but that's not available for a while, uh, which is a bit of a shame because that would obviously make it four. But even then, I still feel like that's not enough LEGO cars to have fun with. Now, I'll admit they've created a fantastic new map for us to play around in. But obviously just three Lego DLC cars is, is a bit of a shame. Um, you know, it's a bit of a kick in the nuts kind of thing. I'd expect at least seven, you know, a bit more to have a bit more fun with. Um, but I guess we'll sort of take what we can get. Um, that, that's really the first point I wanted to address. Uh, the second point still on the topic of the cars is the AI driver cars or the AI cars that drive around the map. They're just standard cars from the normal map. They're not Lego cars, which I thought would 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 be the case uh, but obviously not i think that would sort of make it a much more engaging dlc if the other cars in the map were sort of lego cars and then you feel like you're in a real sort of lego universe so to speak um i definitely think that should have been added in and that would have been a lot more fun um you know f to be sort of engaging with um but again we take what we can get i'm not complaining because the map is fantastic um but you know lego driver cars riding around would be very very cool instead of just the standard jettas and mini coopers and whatever that we have in our normal map just to make it stand out that bit more uh, and then my final point point is is a very niggly one uh, it's not sort of a major issue but it's something that just grinds and niggles on me um, and it's the fact that every now and again in the map in the denser sort of jungly foresty bits they've gone back to using standard trees instead of using the lego trees like they have across the map uh, so there are bits where obviously you've got your lego trees and then if you go a bit further in they're just back to normal trees uh, which again sort of kills the vibe of the map for me in a little in a little way you know it's not a major issue like i said um it's just something that grinds with me a little bit and i think that that would be really cool if they changed them to actual lego trees so then pretty much everything on the map is built of lego you know, it's meant to be Lego Valley where everything is Lego uh, and then you just get standard things, um, which kind of kills it for me. Um, but again, you know, this is just my opinion, so to speak, um, and, and that's how it is. But I would love to know your opinions on this. I want to know if you've got the DLC and if you're enjoying it, uh, what you really think of it, you know, if you think it was worth getting and whatnot. And, and on the points that I've raised in this video, and if you have any other points, you know, things you think that should be added and could be made better, let me know down in the comments. I really, really do want to know. Uh, but apart from that, I hope you enjoyed this. If you did, don't forget to drop a like and subscribe for more videos just like this. But thank you very much, guys, and all the best.